Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Tim Pulaski, and today we're going to be taking a look at how to add connection points to your 3D models using SolidWorks Electrical 3D. Now I have here a basic connector, six pin connector, that I want to make electrically intelligent. And to do so, we're going to add in some connection points. Now, before I get started, one of the first things you'll want to do is create a sketch with a sketch point for every wire that you want to connect to this device, whatever it may be. So you can see in this case, I've created a sketch beforehand in the interest of time with one single sketch point for every pin on this particular connector. Once I have that in place, I'm going to come up to Tools, SolidWorks Electrical, Electrical Component Wizard, and step forward a couple pages and select Create Connection Point by Reference. This is a nice option because it allows you to use a manufacturer part inside of your library uh, as a reference for placing these connection points. So I can search for a specific Molex connector here, say this one, and over here on the left it's going to pull all of the um, connection point data from that particular reference in my library and allow me to assign them one by one. So from here I can select all six pins and then just select in order the pins um, on the device. So we'll go one, two, three, four, five, six. And once I've done that, all I have to do is select the green check mark, and the software will go through and add in connection points one by one by one. Now if I rotate this a bit, you can see that a bit more clearly. All right, so that's all there really is to it. Now this component can be wired uh, into my 3D SolidWorks uh, electrical assembly. Another thing that you might want to do uh, is add in a cable connection point as well. If this is going to be a part of a harness, for example, you'll want a cable connection point. And the process is exactly the same. I'll create a sketch point, say in this case out here in space. Okay, so we'll show that. And this is offset a little bit from the back of the connector, and that's basically where the cable is going to branch out into the individual conductors. Do the same thing. Tools, SolidWorks Electrical, Electrical Component Wizard, step forward a few uh, window panes and select Create Cable Connection Point. There can only really be one cable connection point inside of a uh, electrical model. We'll select this one right here and say OK. And if we finish, you can see that it's added a cable connection point now as well. Now we're all set to use this component inside of our 3D assemblies, uh, harnesses, uh, and um, the, uh, the software will use our schematics uh, to properly route this cable. So thank you guys very much for watching. Tune in next time.